गुड मॉर्निंग होप यू कैन यू कैन हियर मी एम आई ऑडिबल सर नैन फोन विन पड़ती एम आई ऑडिबल विन अभी का स्ट्रीम स्टार्ट वाइव आडिबल लाइव स्टार्ट टेन टेन फारटी सैकंड एम ई आडिबल डिस् स्टूडेंट and all those who are watching me okay uh, let us start sir nim la live lo unnan sir nim live lo unnan please don't call andar ganu padutundi Good morning and welcome to the session. Uh, this is one of the ongoing lectures in C Sharp dot net. So far. we have discussed input output statements if statement for statement while statement and do while statement arrays both 1d and 2d both 1d and 2d then functions passing or receiving arrays passing and receiving arrays strings and string builder in the last class i started collections and introduced a list today so we will learn how to implement stack how to implement queue how to implement sorted list and how to implement dictionary and dictionary and sorted list store key value pairs key value pairs the information is stored in pairs for example roll number and name or phone number phone number name okay etc it stores data in pairs first one is called key second one is called value okay it is called hash map in java and called dictionary in python dictionary in python okay so data is stored like this first 
so a key followed by value okay next another key followed by another value okay and so on <coughs> let us review the concept of list which we discussed in the last class I take very popular programming editor which provides you <coughs> playground for almost all the languages here I choose C sharp Here I choose C sharp and let us start a new program. Okay. So I choose light background so that it is visible to all of you. Increase the font size. We require system as well as collections that we are using collections now. Because we are writing only one class, you don't require namespace. If you are using more than a class, you may require namespace. So we are working with only one class and and at present only one method. And let us create a collection by name list, which stores which stores strings. And the list name is the list name is names okay so let us create space for it store string a size is flexible okay so to this list to this list and let us add add a name okay next let us add one more name to it. Let us add one more name. And finally, <coughs> one more addition so that we have a big list to operate with okay now let us print this list let us print this list using for each statement now you know how to print one in each line one in each line okay now let us run it so this is the output okay fine Now, let us remove, so data structure should allow you to insert and remove. Let us remove using remove function one of the contents. Okay. 
okay see how it works let us see the output server is a bit slow so this is for removing an item but is still trying okay now if you want to remove if you want to remove at a specified position <coughs> you use a function remove at remove at a specified position okay so i want to remove say zero zero element okay remove is removing an item remove at is removing a specified item okay now there is one more function called insert 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 at say position 1 at position 1 this is inserting okay so you have all the necessary functions you can add you can remove okay you can insert you can remove at so this is how this is how the list works okay and let us go to a stack now let us go to stack you know stack is last in last in and first out data structure it has methods push pop okay you push item at the top of the stack at the top of the stack and you pop item from the top of the stack okay you can count the elements also using the method count okay so pop pop removes item pop removes item whereas peek will just will just give a glance of the item a glance of the item okay now let us implement this let us implement it so let us kill this not responding and start a fresh one kill this and start a fresh one Server is very slow.
okay let us create a stack this time stack of integers stack of integers stack name is my stack create space for it <coughs> is a stack of integers stack size is unknown now stack to add elements use push function push say item push one more item let us put some more let us print the stack for each for each int item in my stack print on console one in each line okay now what is that item to see the output my stack doesn't exist there is some syntax error spelling is wrong this is my stack and this is my stack my stack so this seems to be okay now let us see the output so these are the elements the last one entered appears first the last one entered appears first this is the first one entered so this is how the stack behaves now let us let us remove the top one and store this and store this in a variable called top okay now print the stack and print the one which you removed as well okay item just removed so what is that that is top okay so you removed 130 the stack contains 120 item just removed is top should not put comma here put plus okay item removed is 130 the stack has 120 and 100 okay is this clear now let us print let us print the stack top current stack top current stack top is current stack top is my stack dot peak okay
again taking too much of time. Okay, similarly you can find out, you can find out stack count also. Syntax error here. Just kill this and do it again. Say so stack contains integers. Name is my stack. Create memory for it stack of integers. Let us add one element to it. My stack dot my stack dot push say 100 now console dot write line print the top element of the stack print the top element of the stack there's only one element here and that will be printed I forgot to put parenthesis here. So stack contains integers. My stack. Somebody said it's not clear. I take white background. is equal to new stack hint uh, my stack dot push let us do something now console dot write a line my stack dot peep let us run it and see the output
सॉरी फॉर इनकन्वीनियंस स्टैक इंट माय स्टैक स्टैक न्यू स्टैक माइ स्टैक डॉट पुश कंसोल डॉट राइट लाइन लेट एस प्रिंट द साइज ऑफ द स्टैक माइ स्टैक डॉट काउंट count is 1 count is 1 okay it is do for peak also to display the top of the item so top of the item is 100 okay top of the stack is 100 so, so this is how the functions the functions push pop peak and count works okay is this clear it is peak not peep okay okay you have seen the output also now i used peak what is on the top of the stack what is on the top of the stack 100 clear mr tech learner is this clear is this clear rohita is this clear is this clear or not okay now this is about stack now let us let us go for queue so queue of names queue of names and this is queue not stack of string okay now we have two functions this is first in first out this is first in first out we have n q put in q we have d q to remove items from q okay okay so very simple one need not know anything about programming to do this this is my q okay now to my q to my q i n q i put something in q okay so q is q is so cities and first city is say karnool second city is this is cities not my q this is cities okay now let us add one more let us enq one more 
you need not write any code you can directly make use of make use of existing methods so i nq one more i nq one more okay let us nq one more let us print so for each for each city in cities print on console or write on console i want to print all of them in one line so i need not use write line i simply use write okay they are separated by a blank space so let us check the spellings and q q string console dot write for each okay so this should work and this is a bit slow okay now to remove something to remove something not something under first element because first in first out we use dq d e q u e u e okay so what is removed kernel is removed because kernel entered first right Uh, there is a lot of load on this compiler going very slow okay so this is about q and let us go to the next one this is sorted list it stores it stores key value pairs in sorted order and dictionary also stores them the key value pairs but the order you enter the order we we enter not sorted syntax is say sorted list say first item is integer second item is string first item is integer and second item is string okay so name of this is roll call a roll call or employee say employee create is create some space for it sorted list okay
now it has two elements one is integer and one is one is string size is unknown okay now emp dot add first one is first one is employee id say 101 okay name is say vijay next next let us add one more employee first is integer second is name okay now let us add one more okay now how do you print for each for each key value pay each word is each word starts from a capital case letter in key case capital are you following it are you following this now please let me know no response come on please say something are you following it what about others only rohita is responding What about others? So please let me know. Okay. Key value paid. Let us call this as employee. In, in EMP. Let us call this as employees. Let us call this as employees. employees okay so employee in employees console you are printing on console not printing writing right now employee dot dot key okay employee dot key some blank space followed by employee dot value employee dot value okay this is clear employee dot key will return 101 employee dot value will return vijay for second employees for second of employees 102 and ajay so hope you understand it okay this is clear similarly you can remove you can insert you can do whatever you want this is called organizing data organizing data in key value value page okay this is clear now See, because it is a sorted list, you get output like this. First, first Ajay, and then Amala, and then Vijay. Okay? Okay. Now, it is sorted as per key. It is sorted as per key. 
suppose this key is 105 and then and then you get 103 first and then you get 105 next is this clear is this clear sorted as per keys let us try it same sorted sorted list first integer and then string and then string followed by the list of the name of the list okay now create some space for it using new operator new sorted sorted list it has two members int and int and string okay size is unknown so you can add now two employees two employees add in c sharp all the methods start with capital case letter and okay so let it be 102 let us add one more let us add one more record and this is say 101 say um, Vimla now print it for each key value pay employee in employees employee in employees on console write one line at a time emp dot key plus some blank space plus emp dot value So let us run it. Hope all the spellings are correct. So seems you got some output. I think let us try a dictionary. And then try with key value pay does not contain definition. Think. It's a method rather than value. Dictionary employees add. Say sorted, sorted list in C sharp. Let us check the methods. So we added.
Well, let us try differently. This is sorted list. This is also sorted list. Integer key in employees employees first print key and then and then value by giving key by giving key let us see whether it works or not First one is int, second one is string. Key is int. Let us do one thing. Let us check both both of them as strings and check. Let us make this as a string. Now this is string. System dot collections dot generic key value pair doing some mistake sorted sorted list string and string employees dot add for each string. Now we must mention, we must mention type of key and type of type of key and type of value. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is employees. String, string. Let's do it afresh. Whenever there is problem, let us do it afresh. Sorted list. String, string. Employees. Let us call employee only. Shortcut. New. Sorted list, both are strings, type of key and type of value. Say emp dot add 101 comma say vijay. Let us print only this one for each for each key say string string key in EMP on console write 
write k and and its value and its value let us see now hope everything is correct cannot convert system dot collections dot generic key value paid string string to string new sorted list key key value paid say item item dot key plus item dot value small error is prolonging our discussion very small error Maybe it is a method, not a parameter. Let us check that also. Say item. Let us correct them. There is one simple thing. And that's what we did. Item dot key. Key is capital. Item dot value. Say so key. Value pay in C sharp. Okay, so we made this mistake. We should tell what is the key value pair is string comma.
string comma string okay i'm very sorry now this is not a method this is only value so it should it should work now okay is this clear is this clear let us have some space here let us have some space so i have been saying you there is some simple mistake okay is this clear no more speculations please only thing is we i missed i missed the description of key value pair okay now let us add one more let us add one more say 10 The first one is one zero three. Second one is one zero one. Now this is not. This is integer. Now this is. This is integer. Now this is. This is integer. Now this is one or three is. One or three is integer. One or one or one and one or two. Okay. Item dot key, item dot value. So tell me expected output, which will be printed first? Which will be printed first? Which will be printed first? One or two or one or two? Which record is printed first? Which record is printed first? let me know which record is printed first one and now please tell me which record is printed first Which record is printed first? Very good. One not one or one not two. It is sorted list. It is sorted list. It is sorted list. So what is printed first? One not one is printed first. Okay. let us use right line let us use right line now one not one is printed first because this is because this is sorted list one not one is printed first okay is this clear is this clear now in place of sorted list let us have dictionary let us have a dictionary let us have dictionary now you tell me which one is printed first in case of dictionary which one is printed first in case of dictionary which one is printed first which one is printed first in case of dictionary sorted list 101 dictionary dictionary 102 okay <coughs> is a difference clear is a difference clear is a difference clear between dictionary and sorted list
in sorted list we get sorted values whereas in dictionary you get the values as you entered you get the values as you as you entered sorts on keys sorts on keys now i'll show you what happens in sorted list what happens in sorted list in sorted list you get 101 first and 102 next so again it went into a shell okay taking too long but you have seen that right okay so today we discussed all important collections the list the stack the queue okay and then key value pairs and then key value pairs one is sorted list and second one is dictionary okay by using them you can create you can create your own your own data structures okay this is clear say push and pop push pop peak count for stack n q n q d q d q count and peak also for q okay and for sorted list there are some more functions and add for array okay this is clear and add for list as well hope you understand them okay so please do practice them please do practice writing simple programs writing simple programs we don't have time to discuss all the methods here so try learning try learning some more methods but all methods are not required to create a ds okay it's only for literary interest is this clear is this clear so tomorrow we are going to discuss object oriented concepts in c sharp dot net okay like how to create a class how to create an object how to create a constructor how to create a constructor what is getter what is setter what is public what is private what is protected and what is derived class i'll go a bit fast tomorrow because we wasted a lot of time today while dealing with simple syntax mistake 
this simple syntax mistake casted as more than 10 minutes today so key key value pay okay i simply put employee here whereas i should have done key key value key value pay okay followed by followed by and the name of key value pay okay okay this mistake casted us and one more thing happened is solo learn misbehaved so i try to get an uh, some uh, some other id because of overload okay i will try to use i will try to use some other id okay which is trouble free okay bug free right so hope you understand the concept discussed please practice i will meet tomorrow at the same time okay thank you